Now that right there is a proper strike. Let's see how it's done. In 3.1 we got introduced to an awesome mechanic called strikes. And these strikes are basically short cooldown abilities on your melee units that makes them deal damage in unison. And some have additional effects like parry. You might have noticed that sometimes they do tremendous damage and sometimes they don't even hit at all. So that's why I'm going to show you how to maximize the damage from those strikes. The strikes in general work similarly to all Leonidas's uh, shield bash, where the models attack one model they are in contact with, and as such the closer the unit, the more the contact, which means more damage, which means more blood for the blood god. Oh, sorry, <clears throat> as I was saying, in prolonged melee, you want to remember which unit you used first and cycle those just like it's seen in the footage that I'm showing. As you might have seen, at the end of a successful strike, you get to knock down your opponent's models, which means even if they have activated their strike, they will not be able to execute it even if they have gotten back up. So the same thing goes to you as well. As such, the timing is essential. If you did lose the first timing, wait until all your men are back up and re-engage. Now, you might also think to drag yourself closer, but from what I have seen, that can also result in uh, getting shanked even harder. So just don't risk it. So all you need to practice is switching between the units and keeping your strike on cooldown as much as possible. But in general, just spamming will do the trick until you master the system where it can get more interesting and it gets into those mind games. And um, that was it about the strikes. I hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll see you next time.